this was a tremendous asset in the city of Flint. And again, sometimes you have unintended consequences. Flint officials are assuring neighbors that the water is safe to drink. They're ironing out a plan they say will address ongoing issues with the city's water infrastructure. This plan comes after environmental officials say the city's water has too much disinfectant in it, which can cause health issues. NBC 25's Walter Smith Randolph in the newsroom with our continuing coverage. Walter, what's in this plan? Well, Sadie, this booklet outlines the litany of issues people are having with the city's water. Officials say they have to fix valves and storage tanks and the amount of chlorine they're using. They're stressing that while the city has violated the Safe Drinking Water Act, Michigan's Environmental Quality Office says the water is still safe to drink. Flint city leaders sticking by Flint River water. The city water is safe to drink. I drink the water in the city of Flint every single day. Officials coming up with a new plan to fix problems with the city's water after state health officials found broken valves, too much chlorine, sewer leaks, and unlined pipes. We're not the only municipality in, in the state of Michigan that is contending with violation notices. State environmental officials agree, but say Flint's water system needs major repairs. And it's also the condition of the distribution system that has uh, created many areas of stagnation. The new plan includes fixing broken valves and switching to a new disinfectant while reducing chlorine levels. But neighbors are fed up. We damned if you do, you're damned if you don't. If you pay your bill, you can't drink it. If you don't pay your bill, you don't have water. McClinton says Flint was better off using Detroit water, but city officials are confident their plan will work. This was the right decision for this city for sustainability. Now, the Public Works Department plans to implement this plan by February 15th. They will present the plan to city council tomorrow evening. In the newsroom, Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News. Sadie. Walter, thank you. Last night, Burton.